Hey girls, it's Monday and this week on the house's vlog we are talking about our Harry Potter stories and how it has impacted our lives. So I guess first I'll start with telling you my Harry Potter story and how I sort of got into it. Um, in grade 6 a couple of my friends started reading the series and I'd seen the first movie but I haven't had really heard much more about Harry Potter and stuff but so a couple of my friends started reading it and I was like oh my gosh Harry Potter is so lame what are you doing and I was a stupid child just let me get that straight first so I went to the library and I picked up the first book as a joke and I was like oh good I'm gonna read it so I started and then it was actually really good and so I continued reading the series and by the end of seventh book I was completely obsessed and yeah, so that's kind of just how it happened. And then I watched all the movies and Harry Potter is just a really big part of my life now. I remember reading the last book and I was at home and I finished it in like, like I got it one afternoon. I read all day and I finished it the next morning. And I just remember sitting there crying every time there was a death, any time, every time anything happened like when Ron left. I saw for such a long time and with Fred and Tonks and Lupin and Dobby and Hedwig, I just, I was all so sad. And Snape, the prince's tail, I cried for such a long time, so sad. And then when I remember closing the book and then it just hit me that Harry Potter was done and I just, the waterworks just came and I just cried. It was so sad. And then I went through serious post-Potter depression. And all my friends, like a bunch of them had finished before me and then I finished. And then, because we all sort of finished around the same time, I think. I don't really remember. But then, yeah. And it was really sad. And I remember we were all so sad. And then, yeah, this video is going to be really long. <laughs> Sorry. And then, I really hope this uploads. But you know, I bet it will because... Harry Potter week needs to. Um, so then, okay, how Harry Potter has, how Harry Potter has impacted our lives. Harry Potter has impacted our lives, well, my life, sorry, my life so much because I think it really changed me as a person. Before I read Harry Potter, I was not that great. I don't think you'd want to know me before I read Harry Potter, but it really changed me as a person in a good way because I think it in Harry Potter themes like with love and loyalty and friendships and stuff I think it teaches you a lot about life in general and just stuff like that and I don't know it made me a better person and I know a lot of people who haven't read the books and stuff don't understand that but you guys will because you guys have read the books and yeah I don't know it just does something to a person and brought me closer with my friends who have read the books. I think I just share a really, share a better friendship with them than other people because of that. And, um, yeah, I don't know. And then I got involved with the Harry Potter community and I got to meet you guys because of Harry Potter. Um, and then with the books and stuff. And then the last movie is coming out in four days from now. Well, technically five days, but four until we're sitting in the theater waiting because I'm going to the midnight premiere and I assume you three are. I know. No, wait, you guys all are. I think I know that for a fact. But yeah, I don't know. Yeah, so in four days we'll be sitting in the theater waiting to see the last Harry Potter movie and that's really sad. Like, I know it's an end of an era, but it's not really ending. It's still sad though. I just it's the last time I get to dress up as money for a premiere for something. But yeah. So it's almost been I don't know. So yeah, I kind of got into Harry Potter in grade six. And then here I am now. So yeah, I think that's basically sums up my Harry Potter story and how it's impacted my life. My life. <laughs> Sorry. Um, I can't wait to see the rest of your videos and learn your stories. So I will see you next week after we have all seen the movie. Oh my god. Okay, this is so exciting. Okay, so 
Eloise, I will see you tomorrow. And Hannah and Kendall, I'll see you later this week.